This is Mexico City, the capital of Mexico. But did you know that back in the day, it was also where the Aztecs founded their capital around 700 years ago? Yep, back then it looked more like this. Legend has it they traveled around Mexico for 200 years, searching for just the right spot to call home. When they reached this area, they saw an eagle sitting on a cactus, eating a snake, and took it as a sign to establish their city of Tenochtitlan right in the Valley of Mexico. Like the Maya and the Mississippians, the Aztecs used a class system. The emperor was at the top, followed by priests, nobles and warriors, workers and craftsmen, and slaves. The Aztecs were farmers, but since the eagle was sitting on a cactus on an island surrounded by a lake, farmland was a problem. Since they didn't have enough land to farm to feed everyone, they had to get creative and step up their game. They weaved reeds together to make like floating rafts that they could pile and load them up with layers of mud and plants. This created these floating islands of farmland they could plant on. Just like many other tribes, corn was the top crop. The Aztecs built amazing box-like pyramids using no wheels or cranes. Eventually, the Aztec people fell victim to wars and diseases brought by Spanish explorers. But their architectural ruins and artwork can still be visited today, and words from their language are still spoken. Words like avocado, chili, coyote, and my favorite, chocolate. Yep, even hundreds of years later, our culture is still influenced by their culture. Maybe you? and find some other influences of Aztec culture in your life.